Okay, so what we have here, let me just bring this down. I'm attempting to unstick these fuel injectors. The first one here, he was no problem. What, well, let me back up a little bit. Got a AC power supply, Variac, and a um, isolation transformer so I can control the voltage, monitor the amps. I've got the injectors hooked up in series, and I've got a diode hooked up to take the AC and turn it into a, a um, half wave rectifier with no filtering so you just get like a sine wave flat, sine wave flat because it cuts off the bottom half of the diode does that and it's well 60 hertz so you can hear it humming away uh, when I first turned it on in the series this the very first injector he was fine he was just clicking away humming sounded great the rest of these are stone dead quiet so about 10 minutes into the process this guy came on board that's he just he just opened up and started humming away so these one two three four are still dead and I'm hoping uh, by just you know running them maybe the vibration might uh, from the electromagnet inside there might break it free this one I'm trying a little more aggressive experiment this is PB blaster I'm trying to suck it through the injector with a vacuum I got about 25 inches of mercury there and it's just soaking in the PB blaster uh, it's holding vacuum it's obviously sealed up as it should be when it's turned off but I'm hoping that if it just breaks a little bit loose it might start flowing uh, I don't really know how to get any other way of doing this uh, to get that that PB blaster down in the thing but anyway so I just crank it up I'm watching my amps I'm trying to keep it below you know about a half amp seems to be enough so I'm about half amp here, which is about, I don't know, I don't know how accurate that is, but it says about 15 volts, I guess. So 15 divided by 5, that's only 3 volts per. But that one's clearly, he's okay, but the rest of these are dead stop. And I also listen to this with a stethoscope to hear them. But I'm just going to keep an eye on this and see if it doesn't uh, if this one doesn't come alive after a while I don't know if these others are salvageable or not or what you have to do to clean them maybe there's a uh, a process where you can uh, put them in an ultrasonic cleaner or something like that I don't know how the pros do it but this I think these may be beyond just needing cleaning I mean obviously these things are frozen tight so we'll see how this process works but I thought I'd share it with you my uh, my setup that is not going anywhere I pulled back in here and I had a few bubbles coming here I was starting to get a little bit encouraged at first but that might have been just some PB blaster that I had put down inside the uh, the feed line here getting sucked up so maybe nothing came through the, the pencil itself anyway it was funny because I was listening to this one he was making noise I took him out of the series all dead silent and then just out of nowhere this guy came alive I was kind of hoping Russell might start doing that too maybe I was hoping to catch it on camera but clearly there's no telling how long that could take. Anyway, more later. Thanks for watching.